And continuing our team coverage this morning, we still don't have a firm date for when the economy will reopen, when people can return to work and hit kids can head back to school. Well, President Trump hopes it'll be just a few weeks. Governor Lamont says that date is probably premature. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Eva Zamaris joins us live now in the newsroom with the latest details. Eva. Good morning to you both. Here in Connecticut, all eyes are on that May 20th date, but that could change based on where things stand in a few weeks. Governor Lamont understands that people are feeling anxious for life to return to normal, but going back to the way things were will take some time. I talk to the scientific community all the time, and I ask them to uh, speak out and give them, ask them to give us their best advice. Deciding when things will return to normal is a very tough decision. While the economy needs a jumpstart, Governor Ned Lamont cautions the timing needs to be perfect to better protect everyone and to avoid a second wave of the coronavirus. Governor Lamont has teamed up with governors from six other states to figure out exactly how to do that. We know this multi-state council is developing a framework to gradually lift the state's stay-at-home orders. Details haven't been released, but over on the West Coast, California's governor is shoring up his plans for the Golden State. The prospect of mass gatherings is negligible at best until we get to herd immunity uh, and we get to a vaccine. He said reopening dates would be determined by a few things, including expanding testing and providing supplies to hospitals for future surges. Experts say the key is understanding this will be a slow, gradual process. It's also important to reevaluate along the way to make sure that we're not triggering a new spike in cases. In the newsroom this morning, I'm Eva Zamaris, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.